Joan of Navarre, also known as Joanna, was a Duchess Consort of Brittany and a Queen Consort of England. She was the Regent of Brittany from 1399 until 1403 during the minority of her son. She was a daughter of King Charles II of Navarre and Joan of France. She was the Duchess Consort of Brittany through marriage with John IV. Duke of Brittany and later the Queen Consort of England through marriage with King Henry IV of England. First Marriage Duchess of Brittany On 2 October 1386, Joan married her first husband, John IV, Duke of Brittany. She was his third wife and the only one to bear him children. They had nine children, Jean of Brittany, Isabel of Brittany, John V, Duke of Brittany, Marie of Brittany, Lady of La Gerche, married at the Chateau de Hermine on 26 June 1398, John I of Alonson, Marguerite of Brittany, Lady of Galac, married on 26 June 1407, Alain Ix, Viscount of Rowan and Count of Poirhert. Arthur III, Duke of Brittany, Giles of Brittany, Lord of Chantasayan and Granda, Richard of Brittany, Count of Benon, Etamps, and Mantis, married at the Chateau de Blois, Lower Acher on 29 August 1423 Margaret de Layens, Countess of Virtus, daughter of Louis of Valois, Duke of Orleans. Blanche of Brittany, married at Nantes on 26 June 1407 John IV, Count of Armagnac. Second marriage, Queen of England. Her first husband died on 1 November 1399. She remained a widow for four years and acted as a regent for her son John V during that time. According to the Encyclopaedia Britannica, affection developed between Joan and Henry Bolingbroke while he resided at the Breton court during his banishment from England. In 1403, Joan became the second wife of Henry IV at Winchester Cathedral. They had no children, but she is recorded as having had a good relationship with Henry's children from his first marriage, often taking the side of the future Henry V Prince Hal in his quarrels with his father. Nevertheless, during the reign of Henry V, she was accused of using witchcraft to try to poison him. She was convicted in 1419 and imprisoned for about four years in Pevensey Castle in Sussex, England. After that she lived quietly at Nottingham Castle, through Henry V's reign and into that of his son, Henry VI. She was buried in Canterbury Cathedral next to Henry IV. Ancestry